Hey you guys, so this is the look we'll be doing today. I really hope you guys enjoy it. It's a cut crease with a glitter line or whatever you guys want to call it, but it's a cut crease. Um, yeah. Please don't forget to comment down below what you guys would like to see next or what you guys like about the look, mainly like about the look or mostly like about the look. Um, yeah. Please let me know down below. Don't forget to share the video, subscribe, and like. And uh, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. So I'm going to start with my concealer brush. This one's by Morphe. This is what it looks like. Okay, just flat, just any flat brush will do. And I am using my Tarte Shake Tape Concealer. Hopefully you guys can see that. Make sure you pack this on. Or if you guys use an eye primer, pack the eye primer on. Um, yeah. can see that yeah yeah okay now let's go into this eye okay so i don't know if you guys can see that here let me get you guys closer So that's what it's looking like. And there's this one. I'm gonna use that same brush. I'm going to take my naked to Oh, it's already starting to crease, see? I'm going to also be using with my BH Cosmetics number 6 brush. This one right here, fluffy one. So let's start off. I'm going to test it off a little more. This will go in our, in our crease. With the truth about the way we tied it loose and up, I'm sorry. We could go on and fake it. Now I am gonna go in with my the shade Kayini Kayene. palette that blush palette and I'm gonna go in with this these don't have names but it's uh 
pink it's the middle shade so you guys have this palette use the middle shade the very middle brown that I see I am gonna go in with a darker shade the deeper brown darker brown damn near black Good. There's a trick I learned at school on where all you have to do is you put a line right here on your lash line and then you look up and then it'll mark your, like, your crease but that didn't work for me. It worked for some people but not for me. So I've seen it work for people, some people but it didn't work for me like I said.
Okay, let me redo this side really quick a little bit. So they're still not the exact same, but it looks a lot better. The shimmer on the brow bone. Gonna use ounce in my um, Naked Heat by Urban Decay. So the shade is called Balance if I didn't already say it. It's gonna go on our brow bone. Just a little bit right here. Morphe eyelashes. They're called Flirt Alert. This is what they look like. Flirt Alert. Okay, so while these eyelashes dry, I have them right here sitting. While those dry, I'm gonna uh, put on. My, I'm gonna put on my foundation. I use the Lancome. I use this one. And I just, this is just what I do right here. Put this on, this on, this on. Alright. This should be enough. Said I use the Tarte shape tape. Using the Derma Blend translucent powder. Should be almost dry by now, so let's go ahead. The truth about the way we tied it loose and up, I'm sorry. We could go on and fake it. We still waterline, so let's do that. Oh, burns. We will break it. We make the same mistakes we always made, and now let's face it. This one is called a uh, bronze booster light to medium. Um, what well, who is this by? What is this? Positions formula. Hmm. Is I don't know if that's the brand or I don't know. I got it at Walmart, okay? So that's that. I'm gonna bronze up the face. Cause we're looking a little too pale over here. One more time. The Sephora contour. Okay. Go in with some blush. I'm gonna use my BH Cosmetics brush, this fluffy big brush. It's the number one. And I'm gonna go in. With that same uh, Morphe palette that I used for my eyes, and I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this shade right here. Okay, just a little bit off. Hold on, Bubba. There it goes. Other side. Okay, 
and I'm just gonna go in with some highlighter. I'm gonna use my Anastasia Glow Kit Dip Sun Dipped, and I am going to use my favorite shade, which is Summer, the lightest one right here. Let me grab some of that. Here's my brush. I'm going to be using this brush right here, BH Cosmetics, number four. I'm going to be using the Kat Von D Locket setting spray. I put a little bit of eyeshadow on my lips just to kind of change the color. Looks a lot better in person and on camera. Anyways, this is the final look right here. I really hope you guys liked it. Here it is. Hope you guys liked it. Um, yeah.